What up, folks? I am live here from the Snake River. This is the Oregon-Idaho border. Across the river is Idaho. I am on the Oregon side. Now, I've been getting a few requests about doing a tour of my uh, vehicle, my overland rig. Um, so let's take you guys, give you all a look and see what we got going on from the inside, the setup, everything I got going on. Um, you may have seen this tent sets up fairly easy. Got my, uh, got this pretty thick, man, nice, nice pad in here. Um, I don't need to blow up my sleeping pad anymore. I have one in the car, but I don't need it for this. I uh, got my sleeping bag. Just actually went and bought me a new pillow, an actual pillow today. I've been using my airplane travel pillow and my Patagonia. So decided to get me a pillow. I uh, stopped today and got me, grabbed me one. As you can see, I've added a couple new stickers. Be kind and uh, Bigfoot. <laughs> Anyways, let's take a look inside. This is what I got going on in the back. This is pretty much everything I have, man, to my name. Uh, at the moment, where well, I got stuff at home, but you know, at the moment. Got my cooler, a couple Capri Suns left. Got a little butter in there left. I need to go get some ice first thing in the morning. Keep this cooler cool. That water is pretty cold. Um, it's icing there this morning. Uh, I have me a portable jump starter box, just in case, you know, I leave the lights on, leave the door open or something like that, and uh, battery's dead in the morning. Man, I hate to have that, that problem in the middle of nowhere uh, with no one around. So I got a jump box. I got an air compressor just in case I want to let some air out of the tires and go over some sand or something like that, and then I can pump them back up. And it also has uh, a plug uh, for direct, you know, plug in like the wall plug in so that's cool dc uh current got me my trusty water jug miss gina gave me when she first gave me the um the car so that's cool been rocking with me works very well got a tarp here i uh, got a really cheap camp chair right there uh got like i said i've been using my travel pillow as a pillow but you know just upgraded shout out to that uh got a Use my other pillowcase. Um, I had bought two pillowcases, so use one for dirty clothes. These are clothes that I haven't been really wearing. These are the button ups and fancy stuff that I haven't been putting on out here in the woods. Uh, this is all cosmetic stuff, dew wipes, uh, Dr. Bronner's, little washing powders, uh, shaving kit, you know, basic stuff, basic stuff, basic stuff. Um, this right here is my like kitchen, kitchen and toiletries and stuff. So I got my kitchen, uh, all my camp little kitchen stuff there. Got my new little spade right there, the deuce. Toilet tissue for days, I couldn't buy. I was trying to just buy like one. They didn't have them for one, so I might as well buy four. Uh, stove, bungees, tripod, scissors, little lantern camp stove i got another camp stove up there in the front too uh, as well another uh shovel just in case uh yeah and then a bunch of food um just i need to go actually go grocery shopping probably pretty soon uh coffee you know snacks and things like that just regular stuff regular stuff i think i want to have some uh what's this right here oh yeah new england clam chowder with these tonight these oyster crackers tonight Eat it. And, uh, you know, a little, little sunscreen right there. So that's all we have in the back. I probably could use, oh, one of those little uh, cubes. You know, they got those little cubes for uh, put your clothes in. I think I'm going to get one of those for the clean clothes. Okay, back seat. What we got here? Maps. Maps, quickly accessible. Tennis shoes. Uh, boots. Little nice boots, got my gimbal right here for my phone, quick access, so I can pull out and take a nice few pictures. Got my Granite Gear 60 liter um, Crown 2 pack here. Uh, got my tent in there, sleeping pad, uh, a couple more odds and ends, camping wise. I think I got my uh, rain jacket and stuff in there. My new Patagonia, that's my day pack, my new day pack, new Patagonia Puffy. Shout out to Michael from the Portland Patagonia store once again. Got my uh, fanny pack, cheap fanny pack from Wally's World, and a bag full of electronics, chargers, and all that kind of thing, and 
GoPro attachments and you know, yeah, that kind of stuff. And of course, we got the saucy on deck. Gotta have a seat for the saucy. It sits in the middle seat. I usually put a uh, you know seat belt on to make sure saucy is secure. You know, I don't want anything to happen to my baby. Yeah. That's what we got back there. Uh, what we got up front? Not much, man. Not much up front. Frida riding shotgun. Uh, Capri Sun boxes, trash, lighters. You know, got a little protection over here in the corner and some M and M's. And that's about it, man. But yeah, that is what's going on in the rig, man. I'm pretty much self-contained. At this point, I've been just trying to dial it in, get here things I need here and there. I'm pretty sure it's always going to be something I need, and um, or something that I think can you know make the this this operation run a little bit smoother. Um, I would love to go get me a bike pretty soon. Take this off, get me a bike rack that attached to here, and then I can maybe get a mountain bike and then go home and grab my road bike. And then I have two bikes on the back. And if I can find a way to strap a kayak to this thing, you talking about a one-man adventure machine. You dig? Anyways, man, love and light to all. Appreciate you coming along for that little tour. Uh, as you can see, man, we got sun has just went over those hills there. So, little wind farm. And, uh, yeah, that's what we got. That's what we got. Love and light to all. It's your boy, Double Lackalachie. Peace.